got one more thing I want to show you guys. We can get the sound man to play the music to get us in the mood. <laughs> about to witness one of the most death-defying, dangerous, and mesmerizing magical illusions to ever come from the Orient. At this time, we would ask if you have a heart condition that you please leave the room. Also, if you have small children, please cover their eyes. Please note that this effect is not for the faint of heart. Now, prepare yourselves as you witness a solid steel needle penetrate a rubber orb in the amazing Chinese rubber orb of death. Thank you very much. <laughs> hey, y'all didn't think he were real, did you? <laughs> They're not real. See, I ain't got any. <laughs> Don't you think he's look better, man? Now, I got these ugly ones, but nobody likes them. <laughs> All right, hope y'all enjoyed that. Is this an audience or a jury out here today? <laughs> I'm going to pick you guys a banjo song, and I need to ask y'all a question. Let's see a show of hands of all the single guys here today. All the single guys right there. <laughs> this fellow right back here, sir, how old are you? 15 years old and not married. Obviously not from Kentucky. <laughs> Let's see a show of hands of all the married men that wish you were single. <laughs> I'm going to do this song for all the, the, the uh, single guys. This will give you some advice for the future. I want y'all to, I ought to introduce her now. This is my wife over here on the Side, she wanted me to let y'all know we've been happily married now for eight years. What do you think about that? <laughs> Just celebrated our 30th wedding anniversary. <laughs> I remember when we first got married, I was really shy, and we went to the uh, hotel on our honeymoon, and I sent her in to the, uh, get the room, and she went up to the clerk, and she said, hey, we just got married. I need a room. He said, oh, will you be needing the bridal? She said, no, I think I can hold him down without it. <laughs> Y'all give her a big hand, Laurie Cockrell, my wife. All right, here we go. Y'all listen close to the words. Well, I always marry an ugly girl. Well, that's the only kind. She'll never, ever leave you. And if she does, well, you won't mind. 
Well, I married me this ugly girl. She drinks from a special cup. She's got a great big bottom lip, but the top one covers it up. <laughs> Always marry an ugly girl. Well, that's the only kind. She'll never, ever leave you. And if she does, well, you won't mind. Well, I married me this ugly girl I thought I had it made. But when she undresses at night, the neighbors pull their shades. Now we went on a little honeymoon. I took her to the beach and then, when the ocean saw her in a bathing suit, the tide would not come in. Always marry an ugly girl. Well, that's the only kind. She'll never, ever leave you. And if she does, well, you won't mind. No, she'll never, ever leave you. And if she does, well, you won't mind. Thank y'all. You ain't done yet. I got a real short one I'm going to do now, Dave Johnson. Unless you got a hook, you can drag me off of the hook. Yeah, you can. I'm going to do a quick love song. I'm going to send this out to all the ladies in the crowd, but mainly this one right here. What's your name, man? Pamela. I'm sorry? No, I heard what you said, Pamela. I'm just sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Pamela, is this your husband or your boyfriend over here? Boyfriend. boyfriend you left your husband at home, huh? <laughs> All right, here's a love song. I hope y'all enjoyed my little part of the show. I had a good time. Hope you guys did. You can, whatever you want to. But I'm not singing to you, Dave Johnson. You say that I don't love you. You say my love's untrue. But if I were a rich man, I'd prove my love for you. I'd buy for you a diamond ring and a new fur coat or two. And if my nose is running money, honey, I'd blow it all on you. If my nose is running money, I'd blow it all on you. I'd buy for you a Cadillac and a new Mercedes, too. Well, I'd build for you a mansion upon some mountaintop. If my nose is running money, honey, but honey, it's not. And it's a booger of a problem that I've got. I wish my nose would run in money, but it's not. Well, I'd buy for you a diamond ring and a new fur coat or two. If my nose would run in money, honey, I'd blow it all on you. If my nose would run in money, honey, I'd blow it all on you. Thank y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Thanks a lot. Another hand, give him a hand, old man. Dave Cottrell. I, I tried to quit smoking, and they said, Well, you gotta substitute a candy bar, but I couldn't keep it lit. <laughs> <laughs>